What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Uh, we have got a brand new update for one of the good lock modules called Notistar. We all know that the Notistar module enables us to manage the notifications better on the lock screen. Now you see, let me just double tap uh, and open the lock screen here. You see, this is the lock screen and we have got this icon sitting right here. When I swipe upwards, I will get this panel on which I get to see all the notifications in detail. You see, I can scroll through this to see all my past or old notification with the images right here. And this looks much better than the notification panel that, you, that we see on the Galaxy phones. Now, this is how the notification looks on the notification panel. And this is how the notification looks when you use the notice star on the lock screen. You see, we get to see the images, we get to see the notifications in detail. Now for this module, we have got a brand new update and this update adds a brand new feature as well. Let me just go to the store here. Let me show you the latest version we have got. The latest version is 6.0.92.0 and the update was received on 10th July. At the moment, I've got this update on the Galaxy S23 Ultra. Uh, I don't see this update on the uh, S24 Ultra or the S22 Ultra. Maybe I'll get the update on those phones very soon. Now you see the update size is 10.08 MB and in the change log, it talks about a few changes here. First one is supports One UI 6.1.1. So very soon we are going to get the 6.1.1 on the Galaxy S23 series as well. Then it says changed widget logic on cover screen. Now this cover screen is of course applicable for the foldables. This may not be applicable for the regular phones. And then it says added selection of notification screen background color on the lock screen. Now this is an important uh, new change that we have got with this update. Then it says fixed an issue where receiving notifications with large images caused error. Now let me show you the exact feature let me open the application here so when you open it it will directly show you the notifications and uh, to go to the settings uh, you need to tap on this three dot button and one more thing uh, i need to mention here is we can search the notifications by keyword let's say uh, if you're on the lock screen and you are opening up uh, this particular panel here to see the notification. You'll not be able to see that search button here. I wish there was a search button available here on the lock screen as well. But uh, this is available only when you open the Notice Star module. You see, when I open this, you will directly go to the notifications and we can search the notifications by keyword right here. So it's very easy to search all your past notifications using uh, the keyword search here. Now let's go to the uh, three dot button here and tap on settings. This is where we get to see the brand new feature. Now here you see we have got using on lock screen toggle. You need to enable this to see the new feature. And now when you enable this, you will get that icon on the lock screen to open Notice Star uh, module. Now this is the all new feature background color option. Now by default, we have got the grayish color. Now we will be able to customize this color. You see, we have got swatches and spectrum. Now here, let me just select blue and I can also adjust the transparency here. Let me set it here and I'll tap on done. Now let me open the Notice Star module on the lock screen. You see, it is showing me the blue background right here and we can adjust the transparency as well, which is just fantastic. This looks pretty cool and this is a brand new feature. Now keep in mind, you will not be able to uh, use this feature if you have turned on a sync with lock screen option. So you have to make sure this is turned off. Let's say now this is turned on. Now if I open the notice star module on the lock screen, you will not get that uh, background here. Let me show you this. You see, we have got this gray background here. You're not seeing that colored background here. Now let me just disable this. Let's go to settings and I'll disable sync with screen lock. And now you see, we will be able to see the color background on the Notice Star panel here. Now that is the brand new background color customization option we have got on the Notice Star. Apart from this, we also have a few more settings on Notice Star. We can change the application list. Uh, you can select the applications that you want. You can use user filter list. Uh, we can specify which keywords or applications you want to see. Then we've got start icon settings. We will be able to customize the start icon as well. You see, I can change the color of the start icon. I can adjust the transparency of the start icon and uh, I can, once it is done, I can just tap on save. You see on the lock screen, the icon looks like this. Now let's go back here. You see the notification storage period option is here. We can store the notification for up to one year, which is just insane. You will be able to search any notification received in the last one year if you have selected one year limit here. I have kept it for 30 days limit and I think that is more than sufficient for me. Just in case if I want to search any notifications received in the last 30 days, I can just go to the Notice Star module. I can tap on keyword search and I can just search for uh, the notification. I just search for Samsung. You see all the notifications that I've received are showing up here. I've got Gmail, I've got uh, Google notification, 
I have got the Amazon notification, again Gmail, 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 Google and uh, maybe some message notifications also I would have received with regard to Samsung that will also show up right here. So any uh, notifications pertaining to that keyword will be available here to search and this is a very very useful module we have got on the Galaxy phones. Go ahead check it out let me know whether you received the update or not and if you're interested in this wallpaper you can check the link in the description. Every video I post will have a brand new wallpaper you can check out all my previous videos to download some beautiful looking wallpapers. That's all I want to share with you guys. I hope you have already subscribed to the channel. If you haven't done it already, go ahead, hit the subscribe button and give this video a like if you find this video useful. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.